Hey everyone, Fez here from Crypto Setups. Today I am excited to talk to you about a new platform that's going to be launching in the Terra ecosystem. It is called Apollo DAO and it is basically a yield aggregator platform, okay? Um, but what's cool is they're doing a, a farming event for their token and um, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to use the platform and I'm going to show you um, ways you can withdraw if you've currently got your um, LPs in other platforms to remove it and, and put it into the vaults and strategies that are offered by the um, Apollo DAO platform. So coming back to Apollo DAO, here we are. Again, it is a yield aggregating platform. So what it essentially does is um, any platform that offers some kind of governance token or reward for providing LPs, and that is, you know, two sides of the pair, stablecoin and the governance token, um, you can actually use this yield aggregating platform and put the LP uh, put your funds through it and it will automatically in the back end as you're earning the rewards sell it and compound it into the LP again so that um, say if for example um, and here I have pylon right currently if you were to provide liquidity here you will earn based on the rewards you earn for the mine token it would be around 116 percent however if you used a vault where every block it was taking those rewards, selling it and putting it back in the vault, that compounds to close to 214%. So this is where these yield aggregators are very popular, especially in the Ethereum space. So um, this is not the first yield aggregator on um, Terra. Uh, we do have the Spectrum protocol that, that has been out for a while and the contracts are being audited. But here's another one that is coming out, um, Apollo DAO. Now, What's cool about this is in 16 hours, they're going to be doing a community farming event. And basically, the biggest difference here is your LP rewards. So the rewards that you would get for partaking in a strategy, instead of it coming through and then being put back into that um, strategy, it will be used to purchase the Apollo DAO token. And um, you can see, I'm not going to go into the tokenomics and things like that, but that's what the community event is um, about, the farming event. So you're not putting any extra capital at risk. You're just essentially taking your LP rewards of your current LPs, and it is purchasing um, the, the, the governance token for this. Uh, and the floor price is 25 cents. So coming back to how to use the platform, let's get started. So first things, as always, you need to connect your wallet. I have connected my wallet in the past, so um, I uh, it, it let me, but the first thing it'll do is ask you to allow if, if it's the first time. So once I'm connected, I'm going to show you two things today. I'm going to show you how cool um, it is, how simple it is to actually just use this platform and, and take part in some of the vaults it has on offer. And two, I'm going to show you how to remove your LP if you've kind of got it like on pylon, as you can see over here, I have a little bit. I'll show you how to remove it and then put it into Apollo DAO so it starts um, auto compounding and um, at the same time, you will in 16 hours uh, get the rewards based in the Apollo DAO token if that's what you want to do. So let's jump straight in. So you can see there's all kinds of vaults here. The main one probably missing is the anchor uh, vault, which they have assured everyone that it will go live before the mining event. So um, if that's what you're planning to do, when I go through the part of the tutorial where I show you how to remove the LP from pylon and put it in via this um, Apollo DAO, you follow the same process with anchor. You just remove it from the anchor site and um, come through here and deposit it deposit it so let's get started mine okay I, i'm going to use this vault as you can see all the mirror essentially anything that is giving a government's token as a reward can be a strategy because then you know it defaults to uh harvesting the government's token selling it equal sides and that's a big difference it just doesn't sell it for um dollars it sells its equal sides so that it can enter the lp again that way your your uh, deposited amount on both sides is constantly going up um, okay so I'm gonna take part in the mine token and let's click on mine and a few things that may not um, stick out at the moment you can see that this is the price what's what the platform lets you do is if you haven't entered the LP and you just have um, 
you know UST you don't need to have the the native token you can literally go deposit and it will automatically split it so in this case I could do um, I could do 250 and oh, no, watch out for that zero so you can see what it's doing here is it's automatically buying um, splitting that 250 in half and buying equal sides of the pair and then depositing it in which is cool. Um, the other aspect is if you have the LP token, this is where you need to click. There's a little arrow there on UST, you click on it and then you can actually click the mine uh, slash UST um, LP token. Now what is this? Again, this is if you already have liquidity put in, you don't have to withdraw it from um, uh, from the pool and then resubmit it. You can just unstake the LP component of um, uh, that you have staked. So in this case, it will be uh, coming back here and I will uh, show you here. Uh, I've got it here, it would be unstaking the LP. And after you've done this process, you just come back into the vault and, and you should have the LP amount and be able to deposit it. So first things first, I'm gonna show you the UST component. So let's go in, I'm gonna, um, for the sake of this tutorial, put in uh, $200. Oop, that extra zero always gets me. So $200, you can see it's being split and deposit. I'm going to confirm. As usual, it asks for the password. Okay, so once you have deposited it, you come into portfolio, give it a moment. If it hasn't loaded up, refresh your page. Um, and you can see over here, now, what we'll see automatically happen if you check on this, you'll notice it's slowly going up because um, it will be the, the vault is designed to sell and add back into the LP. But what is going to be different is when the community event um, kicks off, instead of adding it back to that LP, it will be purchasing um, this uh, the governance token for for the Apollo DAO. OK, great. So I've shown you the easiest way to use this platform, which is basically depositing your UST and it will split it into um, into what the vault you've gone into. The other aspect is uh, depositing the mine and UST LP. So this is for users who already are um, in an LP uh, to uh, via the pylon site say you and you want to now use this to take part so let's go to pylon and you can see over here uh, I've come through to the stake section um, and first thing I have to do is unstake the LP and that's all okay so I'll click on this and unstake it great so it's unstaked now, after this, you do not withdraw your liquidity. Just leave it there, okay? Otherwise, you're just an extra transaction fee. What's the point of that? Um, head back over to Apollo. And just for the sake of, I'll click on this again. And now we'll swap it to this. And of course, it hasn't. So if that happens, refresh. This has happened to me before. Okay, so here we are again. And you can already see that a little bit how the price has gone up, but this could also be because of the volatility in the mine token price, um, but it doesn't appear to be that. So over here, let's click on mine UST. So you can see as soon as I have picked the LP, that LP I removed from the pylon um, protocol has uh, become available here. So I've gone max, I hit confirm. There is a transaction fee, so make sure you're planning this well. Excellent, so that's done. Now I'm just gonna refresh again and then we'll go to the vaults page for one final thing before I wrap up this tutorial. Um, you can see now, see, it has added all my amounts into this vault. Um, it won't keep it separate. That's all I wanted to highlight. Now, the other aspect is you can see right away when you come into the portfolio section, if you have stakeable assets into um, something in this case it's usd it straight away shows you over here and you're getting a nice summary of what the apy is um, and once it launches you will start seeing how much you farm based on the total you have in the vault so i hope this has 
It helped clear up a few things. One, how to use this site. Two, how you can remove existing LPs and um, put it into uh, the, uh, the vaults um, that are available at the moment on Apollo Dow. So um, if there is any questions or anything, please um, add some comments. I definitely encourage you to join the um, their Discord group as well. The Dow that they have, the, the tokenomics and stuff, the way they've designed it, I feel is quite well done and you know their their goal is to maintain that floor price of price of 25 cents and at the same time uh, how they create strategies and engage the community and have created value for the token is quite good and that's my personal view so definitely not financial advice um, once again though i hope this has um, helped and if you like my content please share like subscribe share it to more lunatics i am going to try to make more um, uh, lunar terror ecosystem content and the next one on the list is this spectrum protocol um, i am going to cover soon but thanks for watching everyone take care